Hello, my name is Ardi and we are going to solve problem 4.1 from Nielsen and Riddle book. And the question is, for the circuit in figure P4.1, state the numerical value of the number of A branches, B branches where the current is unknown, C, essential branches, D, essential branches when the current is unknown, notes essential notes and messages okay maybe let's start from a first we need to count the branches okay maybe let's write that a we need to find out the branches okay let's count them let's see here we'll have this branch first which consists of the voltage source here one so maybe let's number that one and then that resistance here r3 that is branch number two and then this r2 is branch number three okay this branch is branch number three and then r1 here is also a branch so this is number four and then this two phi delta is also a branch here so this is branch number five and this r6 here is also a branch so this is branch number six this r4 here is also a branch so this is branch number seven and then this dependent voltage source which is 25 i delta is also a branch so this is branch number eight and then what else we have r5 here which makes branch number nine and then this r7 here is branch number 10 and then this branch here is branch number 11 so we will have 11 branches so we'll have 11 branches on the circuit in the circuit okay that is a okay now let's move on to question b branches where the current is unknown branches where the current is unknown okay let's check we have this branch here branch number 11 we have this current current source so we know the current in this branch which is 5 ampere so this is known current <coughs> okay let's find out the other uh branch number five here we need to find out v delta we don't know v delta and then i delta here we do also don't know yeah so we only have one branch that have known current so 10 branches okay one branch is known so there will be 10 branches are unknown. Okay, this is the answer for question B. And this is for question A. And then now let's move on. We have essential branches. <coughs> essential branches. Okay, we need to find out the branches that is not essential. So I think we can we can group this R2 and R3. This is a parallel, so this is a non-essential branches. So we will have R2 and R3. This is not essential branches, but because R2 and R3 is parallel are parallel so we will have 
uh, 11 minus 1. So we can count both of them as 1 branches. So we will have 10 essential branches. Okay, and then D, essential branches, where the current is unknown, okay, essential <coughs> branches, where the current is unknown. Okay, let's see. Because we only know this part here, which is 1. So we'll have 1 essential branch is known. 1 essential branch is known. Yeah, we know that this one is 5 ampere. So we only left with 9. 9 essential branches is unknown. Oh, it's not X, right? It's R. Sorry for my English grammar. That should be R. Okay, and then what else? We have question D, and now let's move on to question E. We need to find out the notes. Okay, maybe let's do that. Notes. And let's count the notes here. Maybe this note here in the bottom. So we have the entire bottom here as note number one. Okay, and then this part here, both of them, this part. And this is counted as one note, right? So this is note number two. And this is also a note. So this is number three. And then what else? This one here. Yeah, until this one. This is note number four. And then another note here. We have notes number five. And is there any other notes i don't think so right so one two three four five okay so we will have five notes in the circuit <laughs> okay and now let's move on to f f we have essential notes Okay, I don't think I see any non-essential notes. So when you have a note like this, so we will have a resistor and they only met with other resistor here. This is a non-essential notes. And I don't think I find I found a non-essential notes in the circuit. So we will have zero non-essential notes <laughs> but then we will have five still five essential notes okay and i think this is the answer for f and now the last thing that we need to find out is the number of masses Okay, mess, messes. <coughs> okay, let's see what the number of messes. This is mess number one. This is mess number two. This is mess number three. This is mess number four. And then this is mess number five. This is mess number six. And lastly, this is the mass number seven so i will have seven masses here okay and i think we have all the answer a b c d e f and g for the question for dot one 
And I think that's all for this problem. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.